hello everyone in the previous video we had uh, prepared uh, the xf file and uh, saved it in this video uh, i will put the link in the description in this video we will start a new model in uh, etabs then we will import the, the xf file I am using ETABS 2016 but if you have uh, about any previous uh, uh, version you can easily follow my tutorial uh, to start a new project go to a new model or file a new model select use built-in setting for display units we will use metric SI these settings are for uh, steel sections we don't have any steel section in uh, our project uh, then go to the next option concrete design code we will use uh, this ACI code then click OK in this project we will uh, use uh, the DXF file so we don't need uh, any a grid system we don't need to create the grid system but later on I will upload the video showing how to create the grid system for the same project but for now uh, we will not create it so select blank you have to change the story dimen dimensions our project is nine story building so number of stories nine a uh, typical story height uh, this is the height of the columns shear walls plus the uh, slab thickness so i will uh, it will be 3.2 bottom story height the same all stories will be similar you can custom story data you can uh, change any uh, data for any story change the name I will leave the, the default name change the height uh, I will keep uh, story 9 as the master story and uh, each and other uh, stories will be similar to story 9 so that when you are fixing anything in etabs if you choose uh, a similar story then all similar stories will be uh, edited ok and ok I will import the DXF file in story1 so you can go to story1 using this arrow or from plan story1 apply okay go to file to import uh, the dxf file go to file import and dxf file architecture plan go to the folder where you uh, s saved your uh, dxf file and select it and click on open you can't choose from these options because this is the first time you are importing a uh, plan but uh, if you uh, want to add another uh, plan you can do it uh, from selecting this uh, option or if you want to overwrite uh, the imported plan you can you can choose overwrite and overwrite CAD and uh, the plan will be overwritten we will we use the meters you can check the previous video we used meters in our uh, plan uh, I said that we will import the DXF file on uh, story 1 so select story 1 and now you can uh, import your plan click on OK and the DXF file your plan, plan is imported if you didn't uh, saw the plan uh, then check maybe you import it on a different plan uh, search for it for now it's on story one and that's it for this video